Hi, my name's Grace, one of the doctors. Can I confirm your name and date of birth, please? Yes, it's Charlotte Borum, and my date of birth is the 15th of May, 1994. Nice to meet you, Charlotte. And I understand you're here today for a smear test, is that right? Yes. And am I right in thinking that my colleague has spoken to you about the cervical screening program and has asked you some questions about your health? Yes. Okay, in that case, we'll just move on to talking about the examination. So to start with, I'll have a look at the outside of your genitals, so your vulva, to check for any abnormalities there. I'll then use a speculum to examine your vagina and your cervix, which is the neck of your womb. The speculum is a hollow plastic tube, which is inserted into the vagina. It can be a little uncomfortable, but it shouldn't be painful. To take the sample from your cervix, I'll use a soft plastic brush and afterwards you may experience some light bleeding. You can ask me to stop at any point. Usually for this procedure, I would have a female member of staff acting as a chaperone. Is that all right with you? Yeah, that's fine. Do you have any questions about the procedure? No. Are you happy to go ahead today? Yes. Okay, in that case, I just have a few more questions to ask. Is there any chance that you could be pregnant? No. Do you have any pain? No. And would you like to empty your bladder before we begin? No, I'm okay, thank you. Okay, in that case, I'll ask you to step behind the curtain and undress from the waist down, including your underwear. Have a lay down on the examination couch and there's a blanket in there to cover yourself with. I'll gather my equipment and when you're ready, just let me know and myself and the chaperone will come round. I'm ready now. Okay, I'm going to come through with the chaperone now. I'm going to examine your genitals now. So for that, please draw your ankles up to your buttocks and let your legs fall open. I'm going to sit at the foot of the bed and I'm going to use a light so that I can see better. And when you're ready, I'm going to pull the blanket back to start the examination. Okay. Are you happy for me to go ahead? Yes. I'm going to examine your vulva now, looking for any lumps or bumps or skin changes. Next is the internal examination with the speculum. The speculum has some lubricating jelly on it, which may feel a little cold. Are you okay for me to go ahead with this examination? Yes. Remember, you can ask me to stop at any point. Okay. I'm inserting the speculum now. I'm going to open the speculum a little now so that I can see your cervix. You will feel a bit of pressure. Okay, I'm going to take the sample from your cervix now. This may feel a little uncomfortable. And I'm just going to transfer it to the sample pot. Okay, I'm going to remove the speculum now. And that's the end of the examination. Please get dressed and come round to the other side of the curtain when you're ready. There are some wipes here if you would like them. Okay, Charlotte. So everything looked healthy today, including your cervix. I've taken the sample for the cervical screening service and I'll send that off to the lab. You'll hear back directly from them with the results. If you haven't heard back within four weeks, give us a ring so we can chase it up for you, okay? 
There's a leaflet here to take on your way out, which has a bit of information about the different types of results you can get. Great, thank you. Do you have any questions for today? No. You may experience some light bleeding in the next few days, but if it doesn't settle, then do get back in touch. Okay? Yeah, great, thank you. Lovely, that's the end of the appointment. So you take care, Charlotte. Today, I performed a routine cervical screening test on Charlotte, a 28-year-old woman. Abdominal examination was unremarkable and the external vulva appeared normal. Speculum examination revealed a healthy looking cervix with a closed os. I took the sample without any further complications. I've labelled the sample appropriately and I've completed the cytology request form. In summary, this was an unremarkable routine cervical screening sample taking. For completeness, I would arrange the following further investigations. Check out the Geeky Medics collection of over 1,000 OSCE stations. You can practice with friends using our group study mode or chat with our amazing AI-powered virtual patients.